Hello, you've clicked on the right video. My name is Turnabout and welcome back to Amnesia Rebirth. Where we last left off, I was trapped in the desert. Gabriel saved me by flushing me down a toilet and the butt snatcher nearly snatched my butt and he came pretty dang close. So where we are now, thanks to that amazing wrap up by me, uh, looks like we're gonna be using the compass again. We're in an oasis of some sort. I'm comfortable calling it that. I'm just gonna go on a whim and say that this is a way I will go if I'm not going through it now. Come on, buddy. You're not gonna open for me? All right, that's fine. I guess my amazing amulet just uh, is not as amazing as I thought it was. I noticed an issue in past recordings. Uh, crap gets real dark. Christ almighty. Don't go near it. Tazi. Follow. Hold. Why? I think... I think she's trying to help us. Oh, Ooh, what god. is oh it? God, oh my god. My god. It's a fucking devil is what it is. Whoa. Wait, so that thing's real? Hold on a tick. Wait just a second here. I'm gonna adjust the brightness, I'll be right back. Ta-da! Suddenly everything is bright and beautiful and you, as the viewer, can see things. <laughs> and most importantly, I can see things. That's the thing that I'm most excited about. Hello? Kasi? Hello? I didn't know this thing was wireless. Yes, I'm here, Doctor. Oh, it's so good to hear your voice. Do you have Flappy Bird on this? You're still... Well... Where are you? It's yeah. The oasis. We were here before. How do I get to the village? We have lit a beacon in the tower. Uh-huh. For the smoke. Smokey. Okay, cool. Thank you. Thank you. Doctor. At the light of the third day, you look to the east. You my blackouts. I have these marks on my skin. Okay, like yeah, I do. Losing control. I feel like you gave me a medicine. What's wrong with me? I feel like if I go up that ladder, it's gonna cut me off. I do not know for certain. We need diagnostic implements, reference books, civilization. What we need is a a, a certified doctor. How about that? Avoid fear. Avoid anger at all costs. Who's this doctor guy? Yes, she needs me. Doctor? Doctor! You listen to me! I paid my taxes just like everybody else. So, so who is this doctor? Clearly he knows, like, oh, there goes my neck. Ah. There's the smoke. Oh, there's the smoke? Well, that was easy. Oh, well, look how easy this is going to be. Certainly no giant doom worms are going to come out and eat my, eat my immaculate pecs, which I definitely have. It can't be far. No, nah, if you can see oh, the smoke like that. Little one. A village. People. A way home. Oh, that's just a scorpion. Paris. You love Paris. Yeah. We're walking in the Luxembourg Gardens. This baby is going to love you Paris. Where that's. Alice used to play. Al where Alice used to play. Please be okay. Where she used to play? Is Alice dead? How in the world did I get up here? Wow, there's a lot of rocks and sand. Um, this doesn't feel right. Like, there's a whole lot of nothing going on. And it's that bird again. I saw you before. What when are you? The village, you can meet the doctor. And Yasmin. She's from Algiers. She's nice. Yep. And we'll figure out what's wrong with me. I'm sure we will. I. I think what's wrong with you is that you're pregnant. I've been here before, have I not? So is Alice my baby? Hello. Yes. Pleased to meet you. What in the world? Whoa, whoa. I, I'm just taking this in now. What is any of this? This is not ancient civilization stuff at all. Whoa, we got like this. floating rocks again. Hey uh, apparently they don't float when I touch them. 
Oh, we got one of these rooms. All right, I'll come back to that. I want. I feel I'm in an exploring kind of mood. Oh, I'm not. Ooh, that's not good. I should not have been in an exploring mood. Uh oh. Listen, don't move. Don't move. In quicksand, you don't want to move. I guess you didn't really have a choice there, my my lord, my goodness, my jeez. I hate that sound. I despise that sound. Oh my Christ. god, where am I? We were so close. What the hell is this place now? Okay, you closed right up on me. Uh hmm. Well, I appear to have wandered into Subnautica. Hello, reception? Anybody here? Okay, I just crossed between worlds again. Was that, who knew that the portal to the other dimension was just in a desert? You know? Really goes to show that we should probably be exploring this planet a bit more carefully. Thank God there you are, little one. Yeah, she's still there. And who else knows? Who else is still- who, who knows what else is still with me? Are the words that are attempting to escape my lips. What is over- oh, lamp oil! I like that. Thank you. Yeah. What am I, part 10 into this series? I know how to use a lantern. Your lack of faith in my ability to use a lantern is well stunning. For she fell very slowly. For she had plenty of time as she went down to look about her and to wonder what was going to happen next. Look at this. It's a perfect portrait of all the loved ones I've lost in halfway through this game. Am I halfway? Am I more than halfway? How far deep into this mess have I gone? I got an achievement called No Me- Oh, okay. I thought it was incredibly bright, but no, it's just pretty bright. Every step we take it feels like we fall. There must be a way back in. Something does not feel right about this plate. What is that? It's like a link of some sort. What happens if I touch it? Anything bad? It's not a trip wire. And that's the good news is that I touched it and didn't die. What are these? What are these? Oh, why are they? I can read them. <gasps> Doss, he's an alien. I'm going to read it like an alien. <laughs> I'm going to read. <clears throat> I have to practice my alien. Neuramics? 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 I don't know what the word is. <laughs> And you're the sign of Ranu on the fourth rise at the eighth calling. I, Atharu, make this record. As Temaku directs, I have compared the most ancient of our records of the Empress's Milady with the newly taken samples. In the earliest of samples, Temaku was correct. The nutritive flow to both organs of genera. Uh, genera. genera were intact, albeit reduced, and therefore they would have been functional before the spinal repair. However, since the influx of vitae, the organs are now entirely withered. Was he has why has the substance not reconstructed them? Did the degenerative malady affect them permanently? I don't think that I, I don't think that's meant to be said as malady. Did it affect them before the treatment began? Ah. I have asked whether I should prepare a report for the Empress, but Tamaku informs me that this is unnecessary. It is, of course, merely of alchemical interest, and no matter her concern, and no matter, and no matter of, no matter for concern, for she is eternal. She is eternal in her name. Yep, 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 yep. Oh boy, even more of this. Uh, I'm gonna try and read it normally. Under the sign of Banu, on the third rise, at the first calling, I, Atheru, make this record. I have completed comparison of the samples from the Empress and from the bones of her mother, Blessed Atuna. It is clear now that both carried this sickness, although it did not manifest in the four bears. The four bears? Ah, but in the three bears, the ones with Goldilocks in their porridge. Now that's where the problem began. 
Excuse me. While Vitae is powerful enough to rebind bone and sinew without repeated application, the health again deteriorates. A single dose is no cure. It merely drives the decay back for a time. Temaku orders that I test repeated applications, quantities, insertion points, timings, etc. in her name. Boy, there's a whole lot of stuff happening, isn't there? What are you? This is a different language. One that I cannot read? Or perhaps it is merely a defected record. Defective? That's what I'm gonna go on a whim and assume. Uh-huh. Yep, it's all broken. All of it's broken. This whole place is broken. You're out of order! You're out of order! Oh my goodness. This is interesting. I went from ancient aliens to future aliens, or perhaps they are still ancient. <laughs> aliens confirmed, either way. I find myself again confined. A day should not matter, but each day feels like waste. There is so much to do. Tamaku tells me that now, with Vitae, I have forever. But the people who depend on me do not. There is always something. Invasion, rivalry, sickness, penury. I have my duty. Perhaps I should end these sessions. Now they've found a way to stabilize the disease. I should be ecstatic. I should accept my fate and move on. It is such a faint hope that they can find any way to heal me. That they can find any way to grant my dearest wish. Now you are eternal, says Tamaku. Now you need no heir. None of them understand. This is not about politics or securing a future. This is not for the Empire. This is for me. Just for me. Interesting. An empire, you say, like Darth Vader? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna need help on this one. <laughs> Elander, Septark of the Enkindled Fortress, has dispatched messengers on the, out on the Outer Isles under the guise of a trade mission, despite our previous warning. It is my recommendation that we relocate three fists of the Second Regiment to the Isles immediately. I wonder how big a, a fist is. What the heck? On the matter of the harvested stock, it has been suggested that with the new chamber development, the need for such stock will diminish. I believe it is short-sighted. This new capacity surely means that we are at liberty to increase the number of factories. With that, we can vastly increase our defense capability as well as increase standards of living across the Empire. This new expertise is a gift. We would be wise to make sure of it. Instruct me, Great Empress, and I will inform the Council of your decision. In your name. Uh-huh. Lots of experiments. Am I in some sort of alien lab? That's the vibe I'm getting. Oh, oh, okay. Well, we're, uh, we're gonna be at one of these types of things where I have no idea where to go for a bit. Alright, I'm sure I'll time lapse it. What is this? Oil. What's that? What is oil doing here? What is earth oil doing here? Okay, what is this thing then? Ooh. Interesting. Oh, it releases power. So, move it over here then. That's not what I wanted. I didn't mean to throw it on the ground like that. Hey, 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 everybody, wake up. How in the world? I thought it had to be like... I don't know if I want to be going through that door. I want to go through this door, I believe. Yes, this looks like the kind of door I would want to enter. Hello? Are there any alien scientists in here? Looking to study my body? My body is great for experimenting on. Uh oh. Mm hmm. Some sort of puzzle. I'm sure I will come back to this. Need to replace the batteries on here. Probably need to move these. Hey, yeah! Get out of here, QB. So, what is this then? 
Pull the lever, Kronk. Whoa. All right. Gonna put something in there. It looks like the thing that they had, they, they put like Scooby-Doo in that in the first Scooby-Doo movie. Anyone remember that? Scooby-Doo was being kept in the cage and they were trying to harvest his soul because they realized that his his soul was like the purest soul and that was the way to gain immortality or something. What the heck was going on in that movie? What a weird movie. Aha, this looks important. Or perhaps this is the important thing. It feels like Ooh. Like Looks like one of those uh magic balls. Have you guys ever owned a TV as a kid? I'm sure you remember seeing those advertisements of the amazing magic ball that just like floated and I don't have I always wanted one but I never got one and I don't know. I I kind of feel like it wasn't really magic. Amulet, huh? Oh, that's checking on my baby. What's going on here then? Another rift. Cool. That, be our way out. that looks like it would be the way out. I'm just gonna put that back on there. Ha 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 ha! Under the sign of Edu on the first rise at the eighth calling, I, Kita, make this record. I like how all these aliens have the same voice. The configuration of the new test gate has been delayed by a failure in a subsidiary node. Mahara, you must complete it on the next rise, as you have been prepared. Place the orb in the center. Select the focusing symbols for this alignment and insert two full cells of vi vit vit I made a mental note earlier on how to pronounce that. Vite, I think? Remember Temaku's lessons, Mihira. Master the orb. It is your focus and discipline that will open the portal and allow objects to be sent through. Is there a portal in my belly and somebody sent a baby into it? Because I feel like... I feel like that would happen unless Salim is an alien. Oh, <laughs> what a twist that would be. <laughs> Hello, my dearest, I never told you, but I am not from this world. That's why I'm so handsome. All right, well, that seems like it was something that happened. Is this the way I've gone? Whoa, I remember you. You were at the beginning of the game. Good question. What the hell is this thing? I said it before, I'll say it again. It looks like the spider baby from the first Toy Story movie. What are you? Oh, it's another one of these things. There was a white sun at the great gate. It tore the air and the land. A corruption of living flesh crawls from the hole in the world and turns all to ash and rust. The control stones have turned against my kindred, shaping them into floating wraiths of nightmare. The city falls. I am to blame. My companions took my formula, some to use it to destroy the Vitae at the gate, others to infect the Vitae pipelines and end the suffering. The gate has indeed fallen, but catastrophically, unleashing energies beyond belief. Still the factory scream. We have failed in the worst of ways. It is my duty to stay at my post, to see if I can find means to end it I have no choice but to use the Vitae. An ocean holds the great empress to life, so a meager portion will suffice for me. If any find this record, know that I was the traitor Kita. Alchemist, apprentice to Tamaku. Forgive us our folly. Sorry, I didn't gleam any of that. Um. Oh, hi. Are you... You are alive. You are very much alive. Who are you? Are you dead now? Probably about to... Yep, there you go. Uh, don't tell me I just released him. Are you dying? You better be dying. Not that I think you're just inherently evil. Kita? Was that you? Kita, what are you? I should have been paying attention. 
My lord, I just killed a man. And for what reason? I don't think this is anything important. Alright, well, um... Oh, joy, another one of these things. Tamaku's early experiments with the orbs summoned an entity, a creature, that scarred the world with its <sighs> passing and wreaked utter destruction. The butt snatcher. The scar took the form of living, pulsating flesh. I have studied the orb, and I now know why the scars appear. I believe I can make use of the same perturbation to achieve our own ends. Maybe not the butt snatcher? I don't know who the heck that was referring to. Oh, there are so many of these things just strewn about. Strewn about turnabouts game. Alright, I guess we'll listen to this. It has taken me many, many rises in the gaps between my work for Tamaku, but finally it is done. I have a formula which is in sympathy with the pulse of the orb. I can provoke the symptoms of the red flesh, and with it will come destruction, channeled through the Vitae network. This might be the answer we seek. Is it Vitae or Vitae or... Or V or V Vitae Vitae. Man, the developers probably should have. Oh God, baby! Are you okay? I'm glad you're all right. As far as we know, you've been through a lot, baby. All right. Well, I'm gonna call it an episode here. Uh, we found an alien lab, and I hope you guys are excited about that because. I, I, I'm asking more and more questions of this game. Like, what is happening to this lady? What are, what am I going through? Why am I going through it? And who am I? I don't know. I have amnesia. Jokey joke. Well, thank you so much for watching. And I would say goodbye. But the next time we see each other is just a click away. So I'll see you there.